Are you ready? Yeah! Hey, what's going on? This is She Share Badness. I'm actually doing my second video blog of the day on USB mics. Um, I actually, just a few moments ago, I did a video blog on the Snowball by Blue, and this video blog, it's on this mic that I actually have right here, which is the Samson Q1U which is um, it's a handheld dynamic mic um, and it's plug-and-play powered by USB and um, Samson they also make the CO12 which is a, a USB condenser mic and um, if I had to place these two mics um, the Samson USB and the Blue Snowball side by side the Samson comes out on top for a number of reasons and I'll share that with you and as I did with the um, the other video blog what I'm gonna do is um, I'll just I'll do some recording in audacity just so you can demonstrate so I can demonstrate rather and let you see side by side what the um, the waveform looks like when recording in the USB mic versus um, just recording directly with your laptop's direct audio now this mic, it's about fifty dollars. I spent about fifty dollars for it. I think Samson is charging seventy dollars for it now because it comes bundled with uh, Cakewalk software. I'm not familiar with the Cakewalk software, but I know it does support VSTs and um, also it allows you to do MIDI composing and a couple of other cool things, from what I understand. Um, but it, it's it's definitely a quality mic. Uh, I like the idea of having a handheld USB mic. Um, for podcasting and also for recording your YouTube videos and so forth and um, you can actually just uh, you can stick a mic flag on it as you can see I did and uh, what better way than to force people to you know look at your logo through the duration of your video and it you could do your own little ghetto news reporter thing because if you take the time to look at it it looks important right not so important important not so important. <laughs> so if for nothing else, the cool factor, um, it, it comes with a stand. It also comes with um, this clip. You can put it on any one of the um, mic stands that you have as well. And um, size-wise, it's, it's very portable. It's just a little bigger than my um, Shure SM57 mic. Um, so it fits into that leather pouch. Would make it just makes it a little easier for you to uh, travel around with it. If you have any questions or if there's anything that you'd like to address or if there's anything that I haven't mentioned in this blog, just uh, feel free to shoot over some questions to me. Um, you can drop a comment. Um, you can actually you can put the windscreens on this mic, but um, I have found that it, it hasn't really been necessary. It has The mic hasn't been picking up plosives, which is incredible. and um, that's one of the the things that I found troubling with the snowball mic. I actually had to get really, really close to it to get decent volume, and because of that, it was a nightmare in terms of plosives. Um, with the Samson Dynamic, you're able to keep it um, the the typical distance away from your mouth that you would hold a dynamic mic. And uh, likewise with the condenser, I don't own the condenser, but I have had an opportunity to use it, and um, you actually keep it the typical distance that you have a condenser away from your mouth when recording. Um, so what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to grab the camera so it can face my laptop and we're just going to do a little recording in Audacity using the um, the Samsung Q1U mic, uh, mic just so I can uh, let you hear what it sounds like and then uh, you can be the judge. Okay, great. Okay, here we go. Um, I would actually just like to make a point to mention the fact that obviously I don't have one of those software programs that allow you to um, capture your um, your computer screens better. Um, hopefully you're able to view this. Um, one thing that I would like to show you is um, right over here, I'll drag this over. This is the, um, the Samson Soft Pre. Um, it has the uh, high pass filter and it also allows you to uh, change the phase from normal to inverted and um, this is actually where you can modify the uh, input gain. Just you can scroll it up and down, which I, I thought it was cool of them for uh, cool of them to actually include this. Um, 
it is plug and play. It's not mandatory that you download this, but it is a free option that they have available. And um, one other thing that I'd like to mention is this video blog itself is being recorded with my laptop's um, built-in audio, um, just to make you aware of that. Audacity, however, it's recording with the Samsung Q1U. So I'm going to get this out of the way, and I'm just going to hit record. Okay, this passage is being recorded with the Samsung Q1U mic. Uh, I have it probably about 8 to 10 inches away from my face, I would say. And uh, it's not clipping, there's no distortion. Um, and I'm going to give the closest example that I gave in the other video blog with the Blue Snowball mic. Um, just so you can hear how that comes out without the usage of a pop filter and without the usage of a windscreen. Um, Pollyanna, probably Peter Panties, playing with Peter at the playground this past weekend, but she didn't tell her parents. So I'm going to hit stop. I'm going to take it right back. Um, as you can see, I don't need to apply any gain. Um, on the soft pre, I also have it at um, zero. I didn't make any modifications. I'm just going to hit play. Okay. This passage is being recorded with the Samsung Q1U mic. Uh, I have it probably about eight to ten inches away from my face, I would say. And uh, it's not clipping, there's no distortion, um, and I'm going to give the closest example that I gave in the other video blog with the Blue Snowball mic, um, just so you can hear how that comes out without the usage of a pop filter and without the usage of a windscreen. Um, Pollyanna, probably Peter Panties, playing with Peter at the playground this past weekend, but she didn't tell her parents. So I'm going to hit stop. As you can see, it's reasonably clear, professional sounding. Um, Obviously, I can use this mic for recording my video blogs and so forth, um, whereas with the blue mic, um, it, it makes it somewhat physically uncomfortable because you do need to kind of hunch over into it. It is a quality mic, um, not to take anything away from the Snowball, um, but you do need to make sure that with that mic in particular, um, that you're no more than, say, three inches away from it in order to get the necessary level of um, volume. Uh, now what I'm going to do is, um, did I actually erase that? Let me undo that. Didn't mean to do that. I'm going to close out of the soft free. And what I'm going to do is, I'll go ahead and remove the, the Samson mic. And I'll record using my laptop's direct built-in audio just so you can hear the difference and um, just to make a point to mention it again I am recording this video blog using my laptop's internal um, I, I forget actually what it, it's called but I have an IBM ThinkPad and I, I know with the MacBooks as well um, there is um, the option to record without using a microphone there's um, a built-in microphone Okay, so I'm going to hit record, and on the second track, you'll get to hear what that other audio sounds like. So here I am again, just talking casually, um, and I'm not using the Samson mic. You can see that it, it's clipping somewhat here in Audacity, if you can see the, um, the levels right up here. But um, I'm going to just take this back and give you an opportunity to listen to that. Okay, so I'm going to mute out my first track. I see it didn't start recording actually until over here. Let me forward that. There we go. So here I am again just talking casually um, and I'm not using the Samson mic. You can see that it, it's clipping somewhat here in Audacity if you can see the, um, the levels right up here. But um, I'm going to just take this back and give you an opportunity to listen to that. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to wrap this video up. Uh, hopefully you found this information useful. Uh, if you have any questions, if there is anything that I haven't addressed that um, you would like me to answer, feel free to shoot me a question um, or you could send me a message. I'll be more than happy to answer that for you. Uh, you could check me out on my website, shemusic.com. That's s h -E -M -U -S -I -C .com. Um, I thank you for watching. My name is She. You take care.